Hi guys! You're live with Archie Luxury. My god, I have had absolutely... I have had dog vomit! Dog vomit! Dog vomit! Dog vomit! That's how I've been feeling. Dog vomit! Let me say this to you. Come on guys! Marco! James! Get yourself on the show now. I want to explain to you some terrible... Terrible day and a half I've had. Come on the show now. I want to talk to you. I need some friends urgently. And a very special happy birthday to Dave, my good friend, the super collector. He's 50. Five zero. Five zero, guys. 50 years old. Come on, guys. Get on now. <clears throat> I need to talk to you. I did some. I have got to talk to you. I want to talk to you. I want to tell you the journey, the mistakes, the disaster. Um, come and talk to me. <clears throat> These watches are really difficult to do. Very, very difficult to do. I need to talk to you guys. Get Tim. Get on here now, man. Come on the show now. Uh, I gotta, um, I want to talk to you guys. Who's making, sending, I got a message here. Who's sending, come on guys. Oh, it's just my dentist appointment. Tomorrow, they're going to do some drilling. Come on guys, talk to me. I love you guys. I, I, I got to be honest with you. Happy birthday, Dave. Upvote, Bear Clooney. Tim Wright, get on now. Get on. Come on, guys. Okay, I'm going to tell you the truth, okay? I'm going to tell you the honest truth. I had a very serious good offer on my 6006. Very good offer. Fair offer. Amazing money. It was an Australian sale. Okay, I turned it down. <clears throat> I turned it down. I turned it down! Oh. I had an amazing offer, Marco, oh, on my 6006. Yes. 32,500 Australian dollars, which, to be honest with you, is amazing because it was an Australian buyer. One had sold at Sydney... Vintage Watch Co. Hello, James. Okay, okay. James, I'm going to tell you the story. I was all set to sell my 6006, $32,500. And then I watched Marco's video. Wait, which one? I watched Marco's video. He's so excited. A man at my age is so happy to be getting this sub he sent the money so so james he sent the money and he's just basking in the he's got the he's got the he's got the the flow the the ever flow the the vibrancy he's all ready to go yep and i realized something what's that this is why i'm in the hobby i do love these watches there you go. Arch, can I just solid. say something very quickly? It's an absolute disaster. I signed out of your StreamYard account totally by accident. Oh, and okay. now I can't pull up the Super Chats just for tonight, just to let you know, by the way. But I'll tell you. I'll tell you when they, they come up. Okay. Oh, no, but we, yeah, okay. Okay. Help me. What if, have I done, made the mistake? Have I done something? I, I was... Well, well, seeing as though I know nothing about Padex, can I just ask, is the 6006 the black and white one? Yeah, that's my favorite one. I like that one. Keep that. Yeah, but he's already got a buyer showcase. He needs to start off by selling one. That's the one that's going to go most quick. If that's the one wow. that's going most quick, it's the one that you should you shouldn't sell. Yes, but at the same at the same time, showcase. Let's be honest. He's got five of the things. You know what I mean? A six zero zero six or five one one zero, which is his world time. I'm pretty sure. I mean, those are you both guys, great watches. I got to be honest with you. There's a bit of confusion there. Let's just bring her up and see what. You guys think there? 
That's the one, guys. That's the one. What size is that? 39. Yeah. 22 oh, millimeter good. lug width. Yeah, it's the one it's that's... Oh. Nice wearable size. Nice wearable size. It was a limited edition to celebrate the 240 movement as well. Arch, can you bring a photo up of all your paddocks? Because I have sure. no idea on... Uh, Here we go, Logan Hall, got, two dollars. Yeah, the first paddock is the hardest to sell. 100%, Arch. That's why I say, once you sell this first paddock, it's going to be like the floodgates are open, Arch. And I got to be honest, nothing gives you happiness like Rolex, Arch. You, you, did you see my face in that video? I don't even know what I was saying. I was just so happy. It just came out the top of my head, you know what I mean? Marco, now you're a Rolex man. Does that mean you're going to stop spruiking all these independents? Well, I haven't got it in my hands yet. It's coming tomorrow. It's overnight shipping. If all goes yeah, well, yeah, it's yeah. coming tomorrow. Marco, I've never seen you it. so happy, yeah. man. I've never seen you so happy. That enthusiasm. Oh, my God. It was intoxicating. You know this? It was intoxicating, you know? I was in love with it, you know? Arch, I think Paddock just doesn't do it for you like it did before. That's the truth. I think it's Rolex. Rolex is the one. It's the North Star for you, Arch. I think you got into all these Paddocks for the wrong reasons. Tell me. Well, I think you got into it to prove a point to the rodents when there was no point to prove. The rodents are the rodents. You're, you're the one and only. So, you know... Why do I feel I need to prove anything to anyone? Why am I so insecure? Because you've had a lot, you've you've had years of having dog People toffee on shit me. all over you. That's the reason. Yeah, exactly. David H, five bucks. Keep that six zero zero six. You're gonna have to pull it up, Arch. Don't forget. There we go. I got the full spread there for James. It's in the back row. There you go, James. James. Right. Right, if I was to pick one, right, and like I said, I know absolutely nothing about Paddock, but the best looking one of that picture is the middle set, the, the, the front row in the center. Calatrava, I think, is it? Yes, that's the one I've also offered for sale. I like Here that one. Here we go. One. Here we go. We've got another super chat. So David H is saying, keep the 6006 and Ghost of AC3's Lost Youth $2. What do. What do when girl ha what do you do when a girl has a bigger bush than yourself? <laughs> you know what? I have been there. You know what? <laughs> I am a bushman. I love a bit of bush. It's it's missing. It's a dying art. Okay? It's a dying art. It's like dress watches. Why have they gone? I like bush and dress watches. That's the thing that gives me a boner. Here's the thing, right, Arch? The one, the, I think it's the World Time, the bottom left. That yes. is impossible to read. Yes. The one to the bottom right, I've no idea what that is, but that doesn't it's look that easy calendar. to read. See, it tells you the month, the day, the month, the day. It knows how many. C it can knows you read it? 30 and 31. I can read it. That's why I got binocular microscopes for. The top right is quite nice. I like that. Five, one, two, and seven. I quite, I quite like the top left as well. But I would say, if, if you were to ask me about a dress paddock, which one is the best-looking dress paddock, I'd say the, the, cent, the, the center front row. The 5127. Oh, 5196, yeah. excuse me. 5196, on the blue strap. Yeah. That's I the one that, I told uh, Archie should keep. It's the only one you need. That's, that's just a classy piece. That's just exactly. a nice, classy... The others, get rid. And Arch... The other ones are are a lot are significantly more money apart from the five one two seven, the annual calendar, the world time, the six zero zero six, that's big money, Arch. You can get your condo, make the wife happy, get that investment property. Actually, you know, looking at that six zero zero six, that's the top left, isn't it? Mm. Like with the skeleton hands, that. It's beautiful. I'm I'm, I'm not too fan of the hands on that one. I mean, at the end of the day, Arch, it's whatever you, it's whatever you're feeling. Which, if I had to say to you, right, Arch, you need to sell four paddocks. Which would be the four you'd sell in in order? Which is your favourite? 
I, I think, honestly, probably the world time is the absolute favourite. We'll keep that. Keep it. If you love Look, it, keep it, it. Put it this way. Let me say this to you. If I said, what's my favourites? Well, okay, if we're looking completely peacock, completely peacock out there, I would say 6006, 5196, then I would say world time, then I would say 5127, then I would say annual calendar. That's, that's the order. It's peacock. If I said for sentimentality, sentimentality, I would go world time, annual calendar, 5127, five, uh, 6006, 5196. If I said for investment potential, I would say world time, 6006. But Arch, I think this is what you're caught up on more than anything. I think you're so afraid that if you sell these watches, they're going to spike up in value. But Arch, if they would have spiked up in value, they would have done it already. And your money is way safer and way better in Rolex, Arch. You will make a much more significant return in Rolex. Lolex, Lolex, please. How are you? I'm doing good. Can you guys hear me? Speaking hey, of stupidity. What did I do? I, I want to tell you. I turned down a great offer on my 6006. I heard. How great of an offer. 32 and a half Australian. Oof. And, and they were in Australia too? Yes, correct. Oh. I mean, <laughs> how do you feel about it? Are you happy? Are you mad? No, I'm very happy. I turned it down. I'm very happy because... Here we go. Two dollars. Bear Cooney watches. Sentimentality. Bushes first. Two dollars. Arch, is there a particular? Give us the reason. Why did you turn it down? Was it not enough money? No, the money was very fair. So what was the reason? There was obviously a reason you turned it down. I just said to him, "Would you be upset if I backed out?" I said to him, "Would you be upset if I changed my mind?" He's a lovely guy. Well, he rang me. Well, that tells you then that that watch isn't for sale. If if you if you've if you've been offered a decent price for it and you've turned it down, that watch isn't for sale. So get get that out of your head. Just put that one to one side and say, right, that one is a keeper. So now we're looking at four paddocks. Yeah, I also had a, an offer for the world time, thirty five thousand Australian. And Was it the same good... person? No, another person. So you could have sold the World Time and the six zero zero six within like a it's day. A lot of money. Something like that. Oh my god! It's like what is that? Like over fifty grand? Uh, I'll tell you exactly. I'm 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 just I'm just you know who you know what happened? I saw Marco's video. His enthusiasm. That's what I want. I want the enthusiasm back. I want the enthusiasm for the hobby. That's what I want. He's so excited. That's what I want. I want the enthusiasm. But Arch, do you realize it's how many... It's 67.5. Let me tell you <sighs> this. It was 67.5 Aussie dollars. Let me do that in US because you, you guys, you don't understand Aussie dollars. So that in American. Proud to be an American because at least I know I'm free. 52.8. <laughs> do, do you have to pay capital gains on that? Chat, Arch. Here we go. Alfredo CGC keeping the 6006 because the 6007 went through the roof makes about as much sense as marrying a guy because you like his sister. <laughs> Salad Arch. That's nasty, but there's a bit of truth in that. Are you paying taxes on that? Like, if you, for the gains that you got on that, do you have to pay taxes on it? Ah, the tax man doesn't know. What the tax man doesn't know no, won't you, kill him. That's a lot I, of money. Look, it goes in the, your bank account. The, the you got to account for it. You got to remember. I, I've there's there's deductibles against it. There's service costs. Oh, and, that's true. You know, it, look, look. You'll find your way out. I yeah. pay the tax. I pay the tax. I, I I don't mind paying the tax. Yeah, that's still um, a lot of money, man. Fifty grand. Fifty two. What that's... would you buy with that? A Porsche. Let's get a nine eleven. No, but you know I what? In my that... country, <laughs> yeah, my country cars are going for retail. So what do I buy? An E two hundred to keep the family happy. An E two hundred sure. Mercedes, John James. And you no, still have no, no, three no. more paddocks. You, you, <laughs> you, you take you take more. you take your money out of an asset and putting it into a, depreci a, a, a depreciation piece of garbage. Plastic yeah, yeah, yeah. Piece of that's garbage. a bad move. 
you know what? That's a that's a bad move. And you know what? I rang John Sackahorn this morning. You know, John Sackahorn! John Sackahorn? Yep. And what advice did he give? He said, don't sell it. He said, that's your superannuation. He said, you're in business for yourself. You don't put money away because you don't have to put money into your, your super. He said, this is your savings. Don't cash it out now. He said, what are you doing? Can I, well, first of all. Kryptonite frog. I'll, Kryptonite yeah, froggy, $2, 6006 and world time other keepers. And you know it, big boy. Arch, can I give you some advice that a guy gave me once? Yes. Right, a very, very wise guy who I respect said to me when I was talking about watch collecting and I was thinking about downsizing the collection, he told me that the best thing to do is to put them in a bank safe and leave them there for three months and then see how oh. I felt in three months' time. Just, just passing on a bit of advice that I was given two weeks ago. Art, you know what we should do? We should just go get, give away our plasma so we can get some more money for Rolex. <laughs> what do you think, Art? Donate plasma for money. <laughs> Yes, I'm scared of needles. You know that. I'm scared. We don't. We can't in Australia. You're not allowed to sell blood. Did you know that? My wife wow. actually donates plasma. She donates because she's got a rare blood type, and she's wow, more than good happy for her. To, That's amazing. Yeah, she's got H plus or something. What's it? B plus. Something. It's a bit rarer than you. It's, anyhow, she donates it. No money. We don't get money in Australia for donating. Really? You you couldn't pay me enough to donate exactly. blood. Exactly. I you hate couldn't needles pay too. me enough yeah. to donate blood. You know what? I Didn't you get the what, vaccine? Guys? Yeah, but that's different. Where they take the blood is literally like in a weird area in your arm, right in the crease Ooh, there. I don't hate even it. talk about it. I'll right? vomit. It's so Don't bad. even talk about this. I'll yeah. vomit. Yeah. I had a person who told me how they donated their kidney to their sister. And I was vomiting. Please, just stop. Back the truck up. Back the truck up. I was very ill. Now, look, guys. I want to tell you. Marco, this is, a, this is my friend Dave. I rang my friend Dave and said, Dave, because I offered him first call on it. Toyota Mo, five bucks. Keep World Time and 6006 Arch. Have a drink on me, big boy. Five bucks. I want to say this to you, okay? I want to say this to you. Say it. <laughs> this has been an incredibly painful experience because I went through, what would I want to do? I really wanted a Mercedes Benz or a luxury car. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't even want it. I want the watch. I don't even want the Mercedes or... I Get cars watch. out your head. Get cars out your head. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm here as your friend. Get cars out your head. You'll lose money. I then said, do I want to put it into the stock market? I don't think the stock market... I think we're headed for a correction myself. Stonk rather... advice from R2 Sorry? Luxury. Stonk's advice from R2 Luxury. There you go, guys. You we go. do it all here. I just thinking to myself, you know... I'm starting to realize what makes me really happy as a person. Hoarding and possessing. Hoard and possess Rolex, man. I got, I got three. I got four. I got four. You see, it's not box. enough. I got. No. We want the box. Arch, you had five identical Pateks. Now we want the double that amount in Rolex. Ten identical Rolex. But do you understand, James? I'm Arch, trying I to could... find happiness. I'm trying to find happiness in my life. Here's, I think then here's, well, oh, I first drink, of all, Toyota I Mo. Drink, a drink. Hang on. Toyota Mo bought me a whiskey. I got to drink a bit of, put a bit of whiskey, put a bit of juice into this concoction here, okay? Um, just to show that there's no cheating. Here we go. Ooh, there we go. Toyota Mo. I got to tell you, Toyota Mo. Just gave another super chat, by the way. Toyota Mo. Toyota Mo, Toyota Mo, Toyota Mo, Toyota Mo. Here we go. Three dollars. Just keep them all and fight everything else. I gotta tell you. By the way, this is Moya. You see how it goes funny on the, the video there because of the stripes? That's called Moya. 
Okay, let's turn for this. Um, James. Yes, sir. Marco's enthusiasm. Marco, I want to talk to you, Marco. I love your enthusiasm. You should be so proud of yourself. <laughs> I'm going to say this to you now, man. I am so... Did you thank me in that video? I didn't get to that bit. No, I didn't thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Although, I will say this. I, I have you to thank, for sure. You are the one one of the people who got me this interested in watches are so i mean who else can i possibly thank yeah Mark i mean listen there have been a lot of people who have helped along the way you know viewers who have made allowed me to upgrade this setup obviously er gave me you know allowed me the opportunity to buy this up because i wouldn't have been able to i gotta be totally honest with you and you got this expression art you say it's gotta hurt that submariner hurt it <laughs> it really hurt <laughs> did it, how did it feel to transfer the money? I felt awful, Arch. It felt so like because I paid for a Pam. Like it was like what forty three hundred, maybe five thousand Canadian. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is triple that amount. <laughs> it really hurt. Oh man, it really hurt. I'll tell you something though, Arch. When you see that video that Marco did, does it not see take the you back? Enthusiasm. You see the yeah, you, not... you know what? You know what? I, I realize, James, I want to share this with you, James. James, I want to share this with you. When I look at that video, I realize I can see a little bit of myself in him when he's so excited. You know I what? When I, was, when I was 19, James, I bought a BMW, right? And I had that enthusiasm. It really hurt because I had to sell stocks off and... To see Marco is just so happy, and you want to bring some joy into your life. Yep. Marco, well done, man. Yeah, congrats, Ooh. man. Welcome to the club, we've got, player. We've got a super chat from Tim. Tim Wright, $2. I can't wait for the inevitable buyer's remorse bid. For what? Not getting an Explorer 1? Yeah, that's the ridiculous. Sub is, the sub is... Arch, you know what I'm going to do? The Once the AD better. gets the Explorer, you know what I'm going to do, Arch? I'm going to do something really nasty. I'm going to go in there. I'm going to film. I'm going to record it. Okay? And I'm going to put it on and say, you know what? It just doesn't tickle my fancy. I think I want a Panda Daytona. Think, what? What? Just to take the piss out of them. Just to take the piss out of them. What should you do with them? It'd be funny. <laughs> All right, now. Tell me this, what does, if that, they, do, what does that do to you, Marco? I'm totally messing, by the way. I would look, never do that. Look, I, I would just say, look, look, I honestly, I think what I would do is if I were you, you know, the gentlemanly thing to do is you you can't afford to get both, can you? Uh, l Listen, if AMC gets to $100, then yeah, I can afford both. But no, not, but not at the moment. AMC now? Yeah, it's, it's nowhere near that. Okay. It's nowhere near that, yeah. Seriously, could you, if, if they... Why don't you just go down to your dealer and say, look, guys, you can take me off that list for that. Because I've managed Yeah, but Arch, the one. thing is, what happens if it comes like in a year from now, right? Okay. Maybe you never know. By that point, I might already have enough money to get the Explorer, I'll right? If I save diligently. Yeah, say exactly. Nothing. Say nothing. <laughs> Who knows when it comes. Arch, if they come out with a new Explorer, right? Let's say they they upgrade the movement to the 70 hour power reserve. There's no way some schmuck bald guy like myself is going to get the new Explorer at retail anytime soon, right? So they're going to call me in what? Maybe two years? Right? But that's the Explorer 1 we're talking, not the Explorer 2. The 70 right, the hour would go to the yeah, but, Explorer 2. But the, wouldn't it? The, sub, the sub has a new movement too, this, right? This 50th anniversary we're talking about is for the Explorer 2, not the Explorer mm. 1. Yeah, but the uh, Explorer right? one. Let's just clarify yeah. this. Yes, but yeah. Arch also. They missed the fiftieth. <laughs> Hold on. One. <laughs> but Arch, but Arch, they might upgrade the movement on the Explorer too, right? Because it's got the forty-eight out. It's got the still the thirty-one hundred calibers, right? Yeah. It yeah, doesn't have yeah, the yeah. new sub movement. That's why I'm no, thinking correct, they might update correct. it correct. with the new movement, which would be and a new a reference. And a ceramic bezel and a ceramic bezel. No, that's no, that's no. the Explorer two. I'm talking Explorer yeah. oh, one. Okay. So yeah. the new sub 41, right? The new sub 41 yeah. has a power reserve of 70 hours. It's got the new movement, right? And traditionally, you know, the no date sub, they use that same movement in the Explorer 1. Right, yeah. exactly. Marco, Marco I've, got, I've got some advice for you, right? 
here's what I would do. If I if I was you, right, as a as a Rolex man, as a guy whose testicles have just got significantly bigger, I would walk to the AD with this sub no date on your wrist. I would press myself up to the glass. I'd show them the watch, and I'd just give them the finger. <laughs> That is how a Rolex guy rolls. <laughs> oh, that is good. That is good. <laughs> uh, honestly, it'll give you so much sa- no, satisfaction. Listen, I won't say anything. I honestly, I'm not going to say anything until I have to say something. You know what I mean? I'm not going to email them. I'm not going to contact them. I'll just wait. Who knows in a year's time if I can, you know, kind of pull together the money. Like, I'll still have a few Gs even after I pay off the remaining remainder of my tuition, you know, on top of everything else that I have. So who knows? If I if I get a summer job and I work in the summer and YouTube pans out, I get monetized and what have you, maybe I'll be able to get the Explorer when I get the call. That's why. Don't burn the bridge until you have to. That's, how, that's what I'm going to do. I would chill. I mean, you got a sub, no date. You got a Pam. Yeah, just flip I, I was it, just saying, it, enjoy it, everything. It. I, I just want to say something to you guys here. Marco, James, and Lolex, I want to say this to you. You know, I really love you boys. I don't mean this in some sort of, you know, sexual way there. Yeah, I of course. You, I wish you would, bud. But go on. Yeah, I, I feel a bit <laughs> hurt by that you. comment. I'm getting hurt right now. Hey. I love, Ooh, I love hey. you guys. Hey, congratulations, hey. Marco. Tim, What's going on, Tim? Tim, you're not going to be happy with me. Let me tell you this, Tim. Tim, where are you what, going? You're, what, there. you're going to go rob a bank. I backed out of the deal. I said to him, can I please back out? What deal? Wait, what? 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 What's going on? You know, the, the 6006 was going to... S- the paddock. I was you're not going to sell it? Of- you're not going to sell it to Lewis? No, you know, Nico. Oh, Tony Nico. I'm not selling it. I... I'm sorry, okay? Oh, my God. All right, Tim. You could have lost like $70,000 on that deal. Why not do it? Well, it, it wasn't 70000 <laughs> <laughs> No, no, no. I mean, it's going to be a $100,000 watch in a couple of years. You could have lost that money. Yes, yes, yes. I want to... <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. It, it's really hard to do these jokes. I mean, it's like, no, no matter how hard I... it is. <laughs> I, I backed Damn out because I you got I gotta tell you no, honestly, think... right? Bear Clooney said get out, sell, sell. Look everyone yeah. you know what? I rang the sucker yeah. horn. Sucker horn Sucker horn, I rang the sucker horn, he said He said yeah. that don't sell. He said he said that's the last one I'd be selling. He said that's the one I really but everyone seems it. to say to me I'm just not happy in my life, okay? Do you not think Tim's looking a little bit like that extra guy out of Mortal Kombat? Yeah, Tim, Tim, when are you Somebody going said bougie there? Antifa. I like that. Tim looks like, like a bougie, bougie Antifa. Antifa. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. That's, good. that's hilarious. Yes. I gotta tell you guys, seriously, guys, you guys give me... What do we do with our life? What can is I, our can life? I congratulate Marco real quick? Yes. Marco. Man, I'm so jealous, you know? I didn't get my Rolex until I was like 26, 27. You got it at 21. God damn. Man, God bless you. Cheers, Tamako. so fucking cool. Man, when I get home, I'm going to drink Tamako. I need to raise a toast for the... Yeah, Tim, how, is, how are you not freezing your... Like, man, I walked to the bank. The worst decision I ever made, Arch. Let me tell you, I froze my you-know-what off. Like, it was so cold and windy Marco. today. Unbelievable. Marco? I can I can barely hold my phone, guys. My hand is uh is turning into a chicken hand, so I'm gonna I'm gonna have to drop off real uh, really soon. But I just wanted to say that congratulations, Marco, and Archie. Yeah, man, congrats. That's continue. awesome. Don't sell it, yeah. Yeah. I was man, 28 cool. when I got my first Rolex. Yeah. Right, like think about it. I didn't know what Rolex was. It was so. Ignorant, my God. Marco is on his way to success. That I think not not a lot of us can comprehend. I mean, yeah, really, at 21, really I cool. knew of really Rolex, cool. but I was like, it was such a, it was so out of reach in my opinion. I was like, there's no way I'll ever be able to afford one of those. Oh, oh, you Marco. know what somebody was saying? 
Marco, can you upgrade? Can you go to the AD and tell them you want the Explorer too? Upgrade that. Then you're gonna have a, a chicken, 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 chicken combo dinner, a GMT, and a sub. Actually, that's not yeah. even a bad idea. Yeah, actually, it's a yeah. very good idea. Now, Tim, Tim, let, let's wait yeah. until you get back home there. We can hardly hear you. It's very hard with that okay. muffled... I'm sorry. Yeah. Showcase, yeah. I want to talk to you, Showcase. What did you think of Marco's enthusiasm when you saw that video? I've done a... I, I, as soon as I saw it, I did a video for him. Just to say congratulations. So I put a video up on my... You, that enthusiasm it goes you know that i become an old negative bastard i've become an i'm 50 nothing makes me happy you know that marco nothing makes me happy anymore i think it's easy though arch for pe for seasoned buyers and collectors to just get a rolex in and get an amiga in get the get get whatever you you, you know you buy a watch in because you, you're so used to the sensation of opening the box and seeing the watch yeah Whereas with Marco, this is this is his first Rolex at twenty-one. His first Rolex. That is exciting. You're gonna film that... the unboxing, Marco? Oh, I'll do it. I I won't film it for my YouTube channel. I'll only do it for you, Arch. I'll do it an unboxing the next day I, on my I channel. I would actually like you to do a unboxing. Give me a link. Make it an unlisted video, and I'll put it on the Archie Luxury channel. Right for me. Okay. Okay. Okay, we'll do that. But you, um, you, you're not I, allowed to look in the box first, though, Marco. You, you, you're not allowed to undo the box. You've got a the video you undoing the box. Marco. Yeah, 100%. Marco, please. Please. This is what living is for, James. Do you understand? This is it. Yep. You know, complete antimatter. Mr. J, $5. Mm. Vasher and Constantine, 40 mil patrimony, 81180 for 11,000. Or Paddock, 5196 for 17,000. I thought the Paddocks you could get a bit cheaper. 17, I thought they're about 15 for a 5196. 17 seems a bit high. Seriously, Mr. J. Paddock, Paddock, Paddock. Vacheron sold their ass to the Chinese. What do you want? The Chinese! Or you want the the leader? Paddock is more expensive. It's like buying a BMW or a Mercedes. Let's be completely frank and honest here. Mercedes is a much better car. If you can't afford the Mercedes, you buy a BMW. Same thing. Same thing, Mr. J. Marco, I want to say this to you. Your enthusiasm... Your excitement. I want to say congratulations. This is what life is for. It's living. Marco, please don't ever sell that Rolex. I can't sell that or my Pam, right? Neither. You know what, Marco? Why don't you just buy a few watches? Just put every cent you can into more watches. Become a bear clooney! Oh. You can become your own bear. Listen, that's actually not. It's actually technically not a bad idea, to be honest with you, Arch. The only thing is, I don't know if I'm if I'm willing to kiss the eighties. You know what? You know what I mean? Yeah, do don't I really be a fool like me. Do I really want to kiss the ring? It's like, uh, not really. <laughs> I'd rather be like showcase. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just get prop. Just get a nice property portfolio that cash flows. Invest in in kind of your retirement funds, and, and that's it, man. Just take it easy. Yeah. I gotta tell you the truth, there, Marco. Marco, Rolex, Rolex. Gotta get a paddock. You're gonna get a paddock down the track, aren't you? Hey, what's this VC bullshit? Oh, <laughs> what the hell are you smoking, man? <laughs> Arch, I don't know what it is, and the worst part is I've been watching you for years, and man, there's just something about VC that calls me more than Paddock does. I'm gonna get booted for saying that. I, Showcase. I, I, I have to admit, I have to agree with with Mark on that. There's, there's, there's. I don't know. Paddock just does not do anything for me. Do, it, I just think I'm the wrong guy. I, I, Can I I'm not a dress watch guy. Showcase. Sure. Can we smoke cigars in your room? Yeah. 
Come over to the UK. That, 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 that sofa looks very comfortable. That sofa there behind you. <laughs> come over. How many come sofas over to the, have you got? No, just one in here. Come over to the UK and I'll put you up. Can we smoke cigars? Yeah, do what you want. Drink whiskey. Yep. Oh, Arch, if hey. I get if I get my Rolex tomorrow, I'm definitely gonna come on stream with a cigar. <laughs> A hundred percent. Oh, do it. We Please. have to get cigars. We amazing. have to get cigars tomorrow. It's going to be a momentous oh, should occasion. Should I go buy a cigar too? Yeah, a hundred percent. hundred percent. hundred percent, my friend. Got, got, a, got a nice Habana, Cuban Habana here. Oh, my God. I got God. a pack of Newports in my car. That's the part of guess, right Lusitanias. Now. That's my favorite. Part of guess, well, I got to go to the dentist tomorrow. I can't because I got to go to the bloody dentist. He says, you've been smoking. No, 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 no. <laughs> Okay, um, I gotta tell you something seriously, okay? I gotta say this to you. Marco, your enthusiasm, that's what... You know, when you make a decision, right? When you make a decision... When you make a decision... <clears throat> when you make a decision... I honestly, I was pressured into it, okay? I was pressured into it, but then I thought to myself, what do I do with the money? What do I do? I pay off my credit card, boop. And then what do I do with the money? Put it into a term deposit at 1%, less than 1, less than 1% interest a year? What do I do with the money, James? Listen, I have nothing against people having a little bit of debt. As long as it's manageable debt, and as long as it's a positive debt. What I have a problem with is when people have a debt, say, say if they owe 10,000, but they've got nothing at the other side of the equation. Yeah. If, you've got, if, you've got a, if you've got a debt of 20,000, but you've got an asset of 20,000, that's positive okay. debt. I have, I have no issue with that. As long as you're not yes. paying a stupid, as long as you're not paying a stupid premium. Yes. So don't worry about the credit cards. If you owe a little bit, of, if you owe a little bit on the credit cards to buy the Rolex, don't worry about it. You, you know, your Rolex is going to go up in value more than the credit card interest. If you got it at the right price. But I mean personally, if you think it going back to your question about your about your paddocks, you my my recommendation would be either keep the paddocks, if you love them, keep them, put them in the bank safe and forget about them. Hard and possess. The second option would be to liquidate your assets and put all that into Rolex, which is your second most favourite brand. Shift, ju just shift, shift all your assets back into Rolex. I can't buy it's... Rolex easily. Well, as, as long as you're buying it at the right, forget, forget retail, just forget retail prices. Just look at the market value. So like you've hit a home run with your um, Explorer 2. Over here in the UK, the Explorer 2 Polar is nearly impossible to get because everybody's predicting what's going to happen. They're all saying, you know, the the. 50th anniversary, the Explorer 2, and there's a lot of people saying that the black dial is going to get discontinued. Sorry, sorry, the white dial is going to get the pole is going to get discontinued. And if that happens, you know your, your Explorer 2 is just doubled in price. Oh, that means Arch bought very well. It's true. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. So, he, did they come uh, out Arch, with a new Milgauss? Did you see Bear Clooney's uh, Rolex prediction video? He no, showed the new. The new Milgauss? Oh, I can't even share my screen. Hold on. Hold on. I don't know why I decided to sign out of my bloody account. Ah, oh, that's okay. We'll get you to fix it up afterwards. Don't worry about yeah, it. Yeah, hold on. I'll just share my screen very quickly. I'm just, I just got to find it. James, you can see I got Lolex. Lolex, are you up? still there? Yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I, I just I I had a call earlier. I got the sickness, early. man. I got the sickness. I don't blame you, man. Don't, I got the sickness too. Don't go down this triply slope. You know what? I got respect for you. I want to tell you something, Ma Lolex. I shared the screen, by the way. Can What's I up? share? Okay, Marco, 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 screen up on the screen. Add to it. There we go. What do you think? It looks like a. It looks like a big. My race God, I love it. It looks like a one oh one nine. That was the previous seventies plastic. Holy shite, that could be the... That's beautiful. It looks like a big oyster perpetual. Can I share some secrets with you or not? Please. You know one's watching, are they, or not? No, sir. Okay, I'm going to tell you some personal secrets, okay? Okay, so 
I decided to sell my 6006, okay? I started having dreams where I was talking to dead people who were friends of mine before. Mm -hmm. Dead people. Murray, Mercedes Murray. That was the E320 in a lot of my earlier videos. He was in my dreams. Mm -hmm. And there were a few pump and dump ladies were in the dreams as well. I kind of just... You know, we, we just just it was just a casual arrangement. You know what I'm saying or not? And I gotta be totally I honest with you. I think you've been locked up too people, long, Arch. The dead people were coming into my dreams. I don't know why, right? I wasn't happy. I wasn't happy. Let me say this to you. I wasn't happy when I was selling, getting the money in. I'm thinking, am I doing the right thing? And I just felt bad. I felt really, really bad. Mentally unstable. I didn't want to, like, i got to be honest with you. The wife's very happy. Money comes in. She's happy. Oh, that's great. Money. Sell, sell, sell. I'm thinking, hang on a minute, but this makes me really happy. You don't really care about anything I have. James, I blame you, James. You're the one who caused this disaster. You and your stupid. Stupid downsizing idea. Can I just say this to you? I am really, 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 really... I think the problem is, James, it's very close to the bone. Like, we have these things. What happens if we have 25 hours in the day? They're all worthless, you know that? <laughs> I wouldn't worry about that. I would worry about immediate issues. And I would say the issue is, mm -hmm. do you love your paddocks? Or would you... Straight question, right? If yep. I said to you, you, you can get out the paddocks for a little bit more than you paid for them and put all your money into Rolex, would you do that? If it was just an easy transaction? No. I love well, my paddocks. Well, then don't do it. Like you've just answered your own question. Put them in a box, put them in the bank safe, bring them out for special occasions. Marco, your enthusiasm. Tell me this. How do you feel about this? You feel it sense of it what does your parents say tell me this what do your parents say about this they don't know yet <laughs> they'll know when it comes in Arch. that's what they'll know <laughs> it's none of their business but is it exactly they wouldn't okay. understand either arch they just they'd hear the price i paid and then it's like what you spent that much money yeah so so where what's happening to the watch can you please tell us where the watch is now track tracker tracker track where is the yeah watch so now? So right now, the tracking on it says estimated delivery date Wednesday, March 3rd, 2021 by 12 p.m. And that okay, I got a sign. It is the third in Australia. It is yeah. the third in Australia. So how long away is that away from? What time is it in Canada now? It's 7 p.m. March 2nd. So what are you going to do? I'm going to wait by the door for the rest of the day tomorrow. We got a super chat from Jeff Strip Matter. Jeff Straight Matter, let's talk about this $5. Congratulations, Mark. What reference did you get? He got a 114060, no date sub, ceramic, the 40 mil. Arts, the secret to happiness is more Lolex. More Rolex. Arch, you do realize, right? I was just looking at this thing on a, on a, on a, on a website that I go on. Um, it's the, I'll tell you what it is, it's the entrepreneur mindset, right? Mm -hmm. And it says here, you wake up without an alarm. You are in no rush. You play out your own day. No traffic jams. You work your own terms. You can break at any time. Mm -hmm. You can read or exercise whenever you want to. That is financial freedom. It's right there. Could you send that to me on the WhatsApp? Yeah, of course I will. But this basically, this basically describes you. You have financial freedom. That is happiness. If you think about it, it's true. You're sat doing YouTube right now, right? It, it's it's morning in Australia. Yep. There are people. Ten a.m. Yep. There are people sat in traffic jams right now. I'm just right. I've just sent that into the WhatsApp. There are people sat in traffic jams right now. There is people stuck in offices, miserable. They're making money for other people. 
They're getting paid minimum wage and making thousands for somebody else. You're not. So if you think about that, let that soak in. It's very deep, James. Well, you know what I'm like. Get James. me on the stream, that's how it goes. I want to say to you, I love you. You know this? Well, you I'm not saying this as a homosexual type relationship. I'm a heterosexual man. But I want to say to you, James, I really love your commitment to the hobby. I love your passion for watches. I love your hatred for Rolex. I hate those fikers more than you. The sons of bitches wouldn't even give me a lousy catalog. But you know what I love? What I love about your quest is... I don't think you see the collecting hobby as a good thing. In a typical British sense of humor way, you look at this thing and say... Where's Rolex gone, by the way? He's gone. Where's he gone? Well, he might have just dropped a... He said his, I gotta his tell you, man, seriously? Out. It's coming back. James, James. Yep. Is it an evil thing this hobby? If you could have a, if Jesus said to you, "Okay, James, do you want the hobby or you don't want the hobby? Do you want it or don't want it? Stop your bloody whining." What do you want? Do you want the hobby or you don't want the hobby? What would you say love, to Jesus? I love the hobby. I absolutely love the hobby. And if I'm honest, I'm getting myself into a position where I'm genuinely just content. I, I still think, I still think, I mean, the, the Amigas are in the bank safe where you told me to put them two weeks ago and they'll stay there for three months, like we said. But I'm quite content, four in the box, one on the wrist. That's what I'm living with at the moment. Four in the box. And one on the wrist. One on the wrist. James. Marco. Marco, Marco, Marco. Yep. Seriously, man, congratulations, man. Thank you, Arch. But, Arch, I, I just want to say one thing also. I just because... want to say one thing. I want to apologize to you. Just, oh, just, just between you and me, the only reason I said the 41 mil is so much superior to the 40 was to piss off some people. Arch, it's your opinion. No. You know what I mean? No, no, it's bullshit. I just lie. It's my yeah, own but... ego gone mad. I'm telling right, you, but... seriously. But, a Arch, 40 mil, no it's, got you know I... it's got a better you know movement. It's got a better movement. The case is more what proportional. Has? Your watch, the 41. They're not making 40 mils anymore, Sunshine. You know yeah. that? You know that or not? i got to tell you, Marco. Congratulations, man. That is an achievement to have. I can't wait, Arch. I can't. I'm going to stand by on my sofa all day I just, tomorrow. I can just see myself at every... get... You know, I remember when my, my, my Rolex came in. Oh, I raced over there. I raced over to the... I got it from Anala Jewelers, my 1016. The Rolex had come in. I was, oh my God, it was so beautiful. It's like looking at your firstborn look at, child, James. Look at that marker. Look at that marker. In a few hours, something very similar to this is arriving on your doorstep. The one thing is, is that it's overnight shipping, but apparently Bear said, because I just spoke with him, I'm like, I don't want to be telling people it's coming in tomorrow and like uh, the overnight is late. He's like, yeah. It, with COVID, it's unsure if it'll come 100% tomorrow. Look, just he got it a day later, cool. but whatever. Cool. Yeah. Tell me this, Marco. How do you feel about the decision? Was it the right thing to do or the wrong thing to do? 100% Arch, I think it's the right decision. I think I was sell it, settling for the Explorer 1. And this idea that I would build an AD relationship, it's flat out ridiculous and it's not true. An Explorer is technically a steel piece that is in demand. So it's like the AD is doing me a favor. And Arch, I just did a review that I'm going to be posting after the stream. Uh, a viewer, okay, bought a reference 1680 Submariner from his AD because they sell vintage watches. That's a red sub from his AD with the Ooh. promise that he would get a Pepsi. You know how long he's been waiting for the new Pepsi? Two years! And they told him they'd get him in two months. He'd been waiting two years. He spent like 40000 on a red sub with the promise he would get a Pepsi. And they lied to him. Marco, I told you, it, it's Timothy land. It's, Some it's people ridiculous. have Disneyland. Some people have Disneyland. Yeah. This is what you're talking about. You know what? I, I, I reckon we should take bets 
When does the dealer ring about the Explorer One? <laughs> Imagine they've been Marco, watching the whole time. They take the piss once I once I, I show. I gotta tell you, Marco. I want to say this nicely to you. I want to say this nicely to you. Tell me, Art. I'm gonna have another drink. Buy me a drink, Fukas. Buy me a drink. I want to say that this to you, Nino S. Nino S. Nino S, five bucks. You'll love the Submariner, Marco. Sean Connery, a.k.a. James Bond, War One. That's very cool. Arch, keep all the paddocks! You know what's my favorite Sean Connery film, Arch? It's called Finding Forrester. I don't know if you ever watched it. He was, like, a famous author. And then he finds, like, this uh, kid in Brooklyn. Oh, it's an amazing movie. If you guys get the chance, watch it. Tony Nico! Tony Nico! Now, this is the guy. I gotta tell you, James. You don't know something? This guy, don't ever think, Tony Nico, I'm drinking to you. I, I texted him, I backed out of the deal, you should be angry at me. He said, look Arch, you lied to me, you son of a bitch, you lying bastard. That's what he should have said to me. You lied to me, I organized the money with my accountant. He, you know, he said, hey. Hey, Arch, he actually rang me. As soon as I said, would you be angry if I changed my mind? He rang me. You know what he said to me? Arch, I wouldn't sell it. It's a beautiful watch. That's what he said to me. Oh, hey, ABC. Sorry, I didn't see on the channel. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to interrupt the flow of the hey, conversation. ABC, so I, ABC I, I, I burnt Tony Nico. Tony Nico had actually... Agreed to a price, very fair price, 32500 And guess what, guys? Guess what? what? I stood him up. You, oh, okay. I did all the bad things that you guys talk about. I did it all. <laughs> wow. I reneged on a deal. What do you guys in the UK call that? What do you call that? James? Uh, bailed Being out. Bastard. Gazumped. Oh, okay. Skanked. Whatever. What do you say? It's oh. like that super rare mini. You know, that Cooper S that you bought without the bog. The one without the bog. The guy said, ah, I changed my mind, James. Well, yeah. ABC's been polite. I would just say it's been a bastard. <laughs> but hey, Tony tell me. Nico's here. He's buying you a drink, so he's a good guy. i got to tell you, seriously, you don't know something seriously? I have got how do I break it to the wife? Because she kind of was so excited. I'm getting antibiotics. How do I tell? What should? What, what reason should I tell her? Tell her you love her, and you're gonna sell them anyways. Because that's what you're gonna do, Arch. I'm it's not easy. gonna sell them. I'm gonna it's convince e you to sell them. Arch, it's easy. All you need to do is just tell her that there's been some staff cuts at Paddock due to COVID-19, and the Paddock production is going to be limited even further. Therefore, prices are going to go up. Now's not the right. Just say now is not the right time to sell them, sweetie. Arch, what do you think if I get the call for the Explorer Arch? That I tell him I don't want the Explorer. I want the Daytona instead. William <laughs> Mummy, five dollars. Here's a drink to killing rodents. I gotta tell you. You know what? Have you got a credit card? Don't. Have you got a credit don't. card? Arch, I'm only twenty one. I don't do have not, like a, do I don't not. have a twenty thousand dollar credit limit. Like. When I was eighteen I started applying for everything. I got a Microsoft Visa card. Remember that? Microsoft had their own Visa card. That was cool. I'd have to put it on like three cards, Arch. You could do it? <laughs> Tony Nico! <laughs> Tony Nico. Five dollars! Look at this. I call that watch passion by a true enthusiast. Love you, AC3. I gotta tell you, you know what? I was so sickened. I rang Sakahorn this morning. I thought he, he would tell me to sell it. You know what he says? You're not gonna sell the black one, are you? As long as you're not selling the black one. <laughs> That's what Sakahorn said. Sakahorn said to me, as long as you're not selling the black one, which one is it? That's what he said. So, so Marco feels like he's getting married tomorrow. His bride's coming tomorrow. I can't wait, man. Wait, can I share it with you without revealing what the tracking number is? Hold on, let me try and do it. Just make sure you just can. We don't want anyone... Just be careful, yeah, Marco. No, be Marco. Careful. I want to do, do, it. do it offline. Do it offline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it offline after the stream. Okay, okay. 
Yeah, yeah. I gotta tell you, Nico, Nico, Tony, Nico. I want to say this to you, man. Fuck, I, I have had. I, I really love you. I, the passion. It's the hobby. You understand? It's more about. It's the watches. I don't know what it is. You know what? Can I say this? I might go to the bank soon and get it out and just wear the bloody thing. You know that? How does that sound? Yeah, yeah, James, yeah, what yeah. do you think, James? I think wear it. If you've got it, wear it. Just wear it on an evening when the temperature's out too hot. And listen, when you're out of lockdown and the restaurants are back open and you can take the wife out... Where, you know, Lockdown, it's, it's, it's all over now. You know, that it's actually in the UK, they had massive. The success rate of the vaccine is apparently killing it all. Did you hear that? Oh, it's, yeah, yeah. It's, over here, over here, to, you know, touch wood, we're doing, we're doing really, really well. The numbers are coming down. Vaccine's doing fantastic, but we're still locked down until beginning of April. Oh, I'm so ready for all this shit to be over. I think it's best to be cautious from our side because we yeah. can do sensible things like close the borders we just like i said you can't go to your neighbor next door but you can go to france <laughs> no, it's ridiculous yeah it's ridiculous you can't go to your yeah. neighbor next door my grandparents are getting vaccinated on sunday i think yeah sunday they're getting their first dose Good. here we go if you had a choice of waiting one more day or getting the vaccine now what would you choose marco what do you mean waiting one more day for the rolex yes arch if you told me i had to get covid or get the sub tomorrow. <laughs> I would choose get the sub tomorrow. <laughs> what are you talking about, Arsh? I would survive. It's fine. I would most likely survive. Probably be a bitch, to be honest with you. But I don't care. I think you made the best choice out of the Explorer one. Even if the dealer, even if the AD comes through, I think Look, the sub How do you is... know the Explorer, the dealer's going to come through? They play these stupid bloody but games. Yeah, they they play these even games! ABC, even don't forget if... that. Hey, don't forget that when I went in there, I was bald, like straight up bald. I was not wearing a hat or anything like that. You didn't wear a hat? Why didn't you wear a hat? Psycho? What am I going to wear a hat for? It's not going to cover he anything. I was hoping for a Rolex hat. That's why. Exactly. Marco, Marco, look look at this. You've made the right choice. Yeah, 100%. I love the Explorer. I think the Explorer is a cool watch. I don't think it's a patch on the Submariner. I think this is. I think this is more of an everyday watch, definitely. And I think it's a very slow burn. But this just has a lot more wow factor in it. For your first Rolex, the Submariner is perfect. It's the icon. And yeah. I watched I the dawn. You, Mark, it's iconic. Like, yeah. exactly. It's iconic. The only <laughs> problem with getting that watch is, you know what the problem is? Tell me. You've set the bar too high. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, you know what? Marco, would you consider... Let me ask you this. You got a Pam. Yeah. You got a Rolex coming tomorrow. Yep. What about collecting divers? You know what I want next, Arch? I want a 16700 birth year, 1999 Pepsi bezel. That's my next watch after the the sub. From 99. You born in 1999? Yeah. yeah yes, it doesn't have any old I remember 1999 like it was yesterday, James. I was I'm not getting that watch. What month were you born? March 27th. It's coming. I'm turning 22 very soon. Wow. I was 8 in 1999, so I can't really talk. I, I was in clubs. I was clubbing in 1999. I was really <laughs> depressed in 1999. I had Rolexes, actually. I had five-piece collection. And then I... Really? Ran what did you have? I had the 18238, I had a Explorer Polar 16570, 16610. We got a super chat from RRRR. $5. Arch, trade the old man spot in line for the Vax for a spot at the top of the line for the Pepsi at the AD. You bet you. Oh, you're going to do it? the vaccine. Uh, Anti vax. Yeah, Hashtag that's what I was assuming. Anti vax. <laughs> Yeah, I, was I, I don't agree with you, Arch. If you can get the vaccine, guys, make sure to get the vaccine. Please. Prioritize your health over anything else, guys. I want this shit over. Please. I'll take. I'll tell people to take anything. Johnson & Johnson, Modena, whatever. Just get it in yourself. How about get all of them? Can you get all of them? Sure, if you want a seizure. <laughs> 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 if you want to be foaming at the mouth, why not? I heard the Johnson Johnson one is really good for uh, like younger people. 
if you're like a sensitive person, the Johnson Johnson one is better because it's only it's something less of, and it's only one dose, I think. Hmm. That's what you I love hear. Rolex, don't you? You love your Rolex. Why doesn't anyone in my house love my watches? Even my kids, they hate you talking got... watches with me. Why? Why? Yeah. Why? 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 You got two super chats: Wargasm and Tim Wright. Wargasm, two pounds. Archie looks like Marco's dad. Thank you. And uh, Tim Wright, two dollars. I was paying Pokemon in nineteen ninety nine. I've got to say, there is definitely a similarity between Marco and Archie. Madness. Sickness. You know that? i got to tell you, man, I'm so proud of you, Marco. You pulled the trigger. Man, that's a lot of money to have at your age. You know what? i got to tell you, at your age, to fork out 14... How much was it? 14,400 Canadians. Do you think that was wow. a good price, or what do you think? Oh, yeah, 100%. What are they going for normally? Well, in Corona 24, well, because yeah. Bear also spoke with him. He said, give him the best possible deal. So I know I got a very good one. But Canadian, they're going for 15,942. And I'm getting a 2020 mint, mint condition, mint, mint, mint. Actually, you know, the 2020 mint, 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 mint. That is actually a very that, valuable watch. Well, thank you, Arch. I'm excited. Arch, that's the value of my collection right now. Because that, that, that's the last of a series. That's in Canadian dollars or US dollars? Canadian dollars. That's the last of a series as well, so yeah. I was very lucky to get mine. Very happy about it. Has your, Do you Lulix, have your has your AD come on, up with Does anything? everyone here have their collection on Chrono Twenty Four or not? No. No, is it? It's inflated. How inflated is it? I don't know. It's somewhere between five and ten percent. Two hundred and ten thousand. That's Aussie Jesus. dollars. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Arch, it's like I, Canadian dollars, okay? Arch, I reckon you need to sell a couple of bags. <laughs> what? That's not including the ladies. I haven't even put the ladies in there. You know that? I give those out to the women to wear, and then they bring them back. Or do they? Well, this is the problem. They get very shitty when they give it back. Oh, could I just use it for? No. Would it be you know hilarious the rules, if they brought honey? back? A... Would it? Would it be hilarious if they brought back a fake? They yeah. take the genuine off Ash and brings back a fake. <laughs> no, no, I'm with them. I don't let them out of my sight, but do we? No, look. Has your AD come up with anything? Any trumps? No. Any? No. Nope. No, but to be honest with you, I kind of hope they don't call me. I have so many no things going through right now. What's going wrong? What's suck. wrong? What's wrong at the moment, Lolex? Tell me, well, tell no, me, uh, tell me, tell me! What's wrong? I'm buying a place right now. I can't afford to get another watch. Lolex Seriously, a, do you think Lolex these grandpa paddocks are crazy? Yeah, to I want have, a speedy, damn it. Um, no, if that's what you like, I mean, it's cool, but it really, it just hit me today how much each one of them are really worth. Like, man. You really should shrink that a little. Why do you say that? What do you mean, man? What are you talking about? Because it's like, didn't you say your 5196 is worth like 25 grand or something like that? Or 20, Five, 23? One, that's Australian dollars. 23 and a half. It's not that much. That's a lot of money to me. That's a lot of money. That's a Daytona. It's a lot of money to me, sunshine. Yeah, man. I would, uh, I think the 5196 is definitely a good place to start if you were going to thin it out a little. That's a good place to start. Go there and see how it feels. Do you know my only concern for Marco in all this? What's that? What's that? He's starting with an extremely high bar. Like, I started off with Pepsi! Like Hamilton's... Oh, Batgirl. Ha I reckon a Batman. Get a Batman, Marco, next. No, yeah, no. You know, like... You know, like usually, collectors start off with, with the collectors start off with Hamilton, Oris, Seiko, Tab, Breitling. I have uh, a and, and the, that I'm selling. I'm gonna probably sell. It. Don't tell my brother or my cousin yet, but I'm gonna sell it. But you sort of work your way Why up. Why don't you tell your brother or your cousin? It was a kid oh, well, or what? No, no, because we bought it together at like a Hamilton dealership, and we said we'd never sell it. But um... oh, don't, don't sell it then. Why would you break the trust? Arch, what am I gonna do? I don't even wear the thing anymore. Have they got one each as well? Yeah, but they got it. They got a 
like a different Marco. model than the one I do. Marco. Well, I'll sell that one and get the same model that they have. It's cheaper. <laughs> Marco. Everybody needs a Hamilton. Marco, no come on, man. There's nothing wrong with Hamilton. Keep it. They're not worth anything. What's the point of selling it? How much? Hmm. By the way, Marco. Tell me. The enthusiasm you have, you know, seriously, Marco, nothing in life will give you this pleasure. Women won't. I don't know. It depends on the woman. I gotta tell you, eventually, I've met some pretty good ones. Mundane and boring. You know that, Marco? I tell you this now. You're talking to well, a. Arch. arch. No. What? It's all I'm about sorry. the woman, Sherlin's. I'm telling I've you. I've never experienced that. I've never experienced that. Boring! It gets boring. They don't even want to perform half the time. There's nothing Maybe that you... makes you happy like getting a brand spanking new Rolex and. Gee, five dollars, Arch. Hand down your five one nine six to Mark Load and Mark Mode. Upload a video called "Gifting Marco." And G, if you pay for it, I will do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, we can do that, Marco. Arch, you know what I want to do? I really want to take a trip to the land down under, Arch. We do secret videos. What do you think? Marco, you're allowed to stay with me. I'll, I'll put you up. There's no problems there. You That'd know, be let's so go. cool. Yeah, Marco, let's do it, man. <laughs> you guys got some nasty critters down in Australia, don't you? No, no. Australia is like Canada, except it's hot. It's like, except it's like California, okay? Yeah, I'm going to have to bring some sunblock, Arch. I'm whiter than a ghost. Snakes with and spiders you've got in Australia. I'm sorry, it's not like Canada. Yeah, and crocodiles. You guys have got bears. We, we don't do have, have bears, bears polar bears. Rich Bunny! Congrats getting your first Rolex before your first girlfriend. He's got a girlfriend. They're Rich is that he can't oh, I just realized this was Rich anymore. Buddy. That's hilarious. That's okay. This $2 is, is gradually is appreciate Capone. Rich Buddy. We appreciate your contribution. You know why he says that, Arch? Because he can't please his no. girlfriend anymore. Ah, he's because he needs okay. the Cialis. <laughs> we leave the <laughs> Cialis to get it going. Oh, Stephen K, five dollars, New Zealand. Marco could easily go to the land down under. Just needs to go to his local gym. <laughs> oh, that's good. Marco, uh, tell me this: What's the anxiety like? Tell me this: How do you feel? I want to ask you something seriously. You know how you feel happy about your watches like this? Yeah, you're like stuck in brutal. You're stuck in uh, in limbo, you know. You just don't have the watch, and you don't have the money. It sucks. <laughs> exactly. I gotta tell you truth. No, I, ABC. We just leave him on. Anyone who donates money is gladly accepted. I want to say this to you, Marco. I love you, Marco. I love you. Same here, Arch. Likewise. Ditto, ditto. You've got a beautiful submarina. You will love that watch. Wear it in good health. Don't ever sell it. Just be happy. You know what I'm saying? Life yeah. is short. Before you know it, you're 50. What do you hope to have achieved by the time you're 50, Marco? Oof, some semblance of financial success. I hope to be married. What is financial success? Give me a pre-adjusted interest. I mean, Arch, it depends in, on in your... In today's dollars, what is success for you? What would be successful? If you were 50, what would be successful? I mean, I, I reckon a million dollars is pretty good mark to aim for, right? A million dollars in terms of your total assets between your house, your, I guess, your house, your, your 401ks, your savings accounts, your watches, everything. I by think that's age? pretty good mark to aim for. It's, by what it's, age? It's, it's, by, by 50. <laughs> yeah, by 50. A million dollars at 50 is better than that. It's a lot better than average. Yeah, a lot of people spend money on garbage, see? Yeah. But they also, buy Arch, Rolex. They buy non Rolex! Can I be honest with you, Arch? That's like, that is something I want to achieve, but more than anything, Arch, I just want to find somebody nice, settle down with them, raise a Sorry. <laughs> Marco, 
What the hell are you smoking, man? We can see uh, the innocence, Marco. We can see the innocence. I gotta be honest with you, man. It's the way to go. It's how you lead a happy and fulfilling life. That's why I recommend Archie. You should sell the paddocks and make the wife happy. Marco's Ooh. never had his heart ripped out by a girl before. You could tell. No, no, it's happened. I'm it's just happened. realizing that. No, well, Arch, I've never had it. Think about real. it. Think about it, Arch. Think about it this way: when you're old, and when we're when we one day become old and decrepit, all we have left are the memories, right? The memories and our children, and ultimately, it's the family life that's most important over anything else, over money, over success, over watches. It, you you want to leave this world knowing that kind of your kids are going to be better off than you are, you know? Yeah, for sure. Marco, I 100% I 100% agree, but you're on the AC3 stream. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't the right place to be spruiking that stuff, but I do agree. It's not the right place to be spruiking that stuff. That's exactly right. On this stream, we spruik Bangkok. <laughs> Boom. I gotta and tell you, grenades. you know what, Marco? I wanna tell you something. So James, you know something, James? Why did Hello. you when the whole thing the ship sank, right, with the other guys, the other old crew, why did you stay by me? It was simple. When I got into the hobby, the the well the, the first channel I actually found was T G V. Yes. And started watching his vids and nearly made several big mistakes and then found your videos. Yeah. Your videos basically said the opposite. Uh, followed your advice, kept me out of trouble. Um, and found you're worth seven million dollars today. Seven million dollars US. Ah, oh, I wish. <laughs> I was going to say, Jesus, I are you buying? You why are. are you collecting you're Omega? You're a very successful man. You've got a business that makes a lot of money. Look oh, at that studio. Yeah. That's not like my crappy synthetic. Have you got real carpet? What sort of carpet have you got? I don't know, whatever the guy had on the van. What was no it? Idea. Was it? Is it? Is it synthetic or is it real wool carpet? How can you tell the difference? No idea. Have you got carpet beetles? You don't no, get those in the UK. I, you know, I that, didn't even know. I didn't. Even, I didn't even know carpet beetles was a thing until I saw them on your channel. Yeah, it's it's, it's in the hot climates. Man, you got pics, posters of minis on the wall. You own these bloody things. Those are minis you owned. No, 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 no. The, the, these are um, from the authorised de the authorised dealers, car dealers back in the day. When the one behind there is a Rover, they're both from Rover. Yeah. So they'll have actually been in the showrooms of the mini dealerships. What would they be worth now? That red one. I like the red one. What the car or the poster? The car. Um, for a minty one, probably about fifteen thousand. Somewhere between twelve and fifteen thousand for a mint one. And the blue one, so same. Similar, yeah, but maybe a bit more. What year is that? Uh, so the blue one, well, the red one is an SPI, which is a single point injection. The blue one is a multi point injection. So, about two year year two thousand for the blue one, and the red one about nineteen ninety four. Rich buddy, two dollars. Sell that Rolex and live the four whores of whores. Live it, man. I gotta tell you, Rich Buddy, I love you. Your contribution to the channel means a lot to me. I love anyone who donates. You know this, Marco? Money is very important Sorry. to me because, you know, Marco, I need money. You know this, don't Here's you? Here's what I really think, Arch. Yeah. This is what well, I, I gotta really tell think. you, you know, I gotta tell you, man, I've had some mental problems. You know, I had had serious mental problems. I gotta see my dad today speaking of mental problems. Stephen K, five dollars! Given the history arch, I'm amazed the Carpet Beatles haven't left to set up their own YouTube, YouTube channel <laughs> while asking you to buy smokes and mobile credit! Oh, we got Tim right in the chat asking for the link arch. Link! Ooh, get the, oh, Tim on. in the WhatsApp. Man, I feel so powerless signed out at your StreamYard account arch. I feel useless mm. right now. Let's see how many bags of spanners Tim's got I with him today. I saw that enthusiasm you have. You're waiting for the watch. This is where Man. this is where things get messed up. Tim's going to come on. He's going to throw a lot of spanners in the works for you, Arch. He's going to throw spanners in the works for Marco. Tim is no, absolute comedy comedy gold. What's, what? Do you believe Tim or not really? Tim's awesome. I love Tim. <laughs> Just breaking balls. Come on. Yeah. Do you believe that Tim... shit about him turning down a sermon? Yeah, 
Oh, okay. I know, I know, I know. It's true. It's crazy enough. Why Arch, didn't that... he offer it to me or you? That's what I want to know. Why didn't he offer it to me and you? That's what Arch, I the communists know. are only communists when it comes to other people's stuff, but when it comes to their own, you know. <laughs> you Tim remember Conrad the... Black? Do any of you Canadian guys remember Conrad Black? Oof, the only tr the only one I know of is Jack Layton. I think his name was. He was big Conrad back Conrad Black. You remember Conrad Black? No, Do a Google no. later. Guys, I want to share something with you. You know when you know you've made a right decision about a, a sale or not? A, it's when you... Whatever you've done, you think about it. Got Joe Kramer. Throwing up. I got to be honest with you guys. Seriously? Is Tim backstage? He's just come back now. Tim, how are you, Tim? Talk to me, Tim. What did I do wrong? What do you think of the idea? I told you I was going to... I was going mm -hmm. to tell mm -hmm. you... I was going to tell you, Tim. Mm -hmm. I backed out of the deal! What do you think, Tim? Talk to me. You were really... I want to hear the honest truth. Don't bullshit. No backstage. Just tell me the truth. What do you think, Tim? What do you think? Here we go. <laughs> uh, well, I, look, I think I stay by, I stand by what I said yesterday. Uh, the oh. 6006, that's going to be a crazy valuable watch. I wouldn't start, like, if you're going to sell watches, don't start with the 6006. There's hmm. a reason everybody wants it. Can I just say very quickly, tell everybody to upvote. We got 244 people uh, watching. Boom! Oh, yeah. Up only vote, up only vote, 57 please. likes, guys. There you and we go. got two super chats. One from Joe Kramer up above. Joe. And then Spencer. Kramer. Super chat. Where's the super chat? Tell me the super chat. Which one? It's up above. Joe, Joe Kramer. Joe yeah. Kramer. Did I do the Stephen K one? <laughs> yeah, you did that one. Joe Kramer, $2. Throwing up gang signs for you, Marco. <laughs> throwing up gang signs for you, Marco. Spencer R, five dollars. Laugh out loud. Conrad Black is an anti Jack Layton. What about old Conrad Arch? Mm. Yeah, what about him? He Isn't he jail. British? He went to jail. He went to jail. You know that? It was right wing Canadian who was just a real son of a bitch. <laughs> Tim, talk to me. What do you think, Tim? What have I done? Ah. Uh. Look, Archie, I think, I think you did the right decision, I, but 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 you have to go out and you have to put at least one paddock for sale. Start with that with that. Ah, oh my. God. Five one two seven. Five, no, the five one two seven is so cool. Uh, five one nine six. I mean, let's let's be honest. I mean, it's a, that's a great watch. You're gonna, you, you can still get rid of it. It's it's quite easy, and uh, you can get get it back if you need it because you have the world time. That's a double up, in my opinion. Five one nine six, and World Time. It's the you same watch. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, I'll do a deal with you, Timmy. Get that sermit. Get uh -huh. that sermit for me, and we'll do a swap. Mm. <laughs> Nobody's gonna know. No one's watching, Tim. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> yes. What do you think, Tim? Cash in that oil field and get the. Uh... Tim, just go to another AD I, I, and build another AD relationship. No problem. Just show them. Just show them the models you got, man. Kickbacks. Okay. I don't believe in They're that. Paying protection, okay? Do Tim. you think there's a possibility that Tim's family owns an AD? No. I think Tim's family. No, actually, it's very the hard. That the AD lives in. That's the reality. They own the, the building. They provide janitorial services they, you know they actually I mean? make it very hard for employees and owners of uh ad's to get uh what's it called their their watches from rolex you actually have to like fill out special permission like things that you have to send to switzerland and what have you super bureaucratic and nasty mm. Mm. tim i'm loving the new lighting by the way thank you i amped no it idea. up I did watch the video. I yeah, want to say this to you. Issue with it. Can I, I ask you down. something, 
James, why don't you go and buy one of those minis that are on the wall there? You've got enough money. Mm. You're loaded. I've had, I've had plenty. I've had over 50 minis in my time. Well, why don't they make you happy then? Why don't they make mm. you happy? Oh, they did at the time. I've just, I've just slowly got out of them. I think once I had kids, once I had kids, I, I couldn't spend the time in the workshop, you know, playing with them, fiddling about with them. So it was about the same time as I set you the know YouTube that channel up. Sir actually. Isaacs, the guy who designed the mini, Alec Isagonis. He was a little bit of a right wing guy, wasn't he? I don't really know, really. Much of Britain was in those days. Yeah. Yeah. He designed also the Maxi, didn't he? Hmm. I think he... It possibly, uh, I'm not sure. I would... Re Did you ever hear that hydroponic suspension? Hydro... Hydroelastic. Hydro yes. What did you think of that? It was okay. It was, it, it was on the very early minis. It was on the Mark 1s, but then they dropped it. But Alec Gizagonis, he... Um, it was the mini was the first the first car to ever have a transverse engine. Did you know that? Is that right? What's one yeah, of those? First... And also, it used the the oil was shared for With the, the gearbox, gearbox and, and the, the clutch. Engine. Was that a good yeah. idea or not? Yeah, well, most of it leaks out, but yeah. So basically, for those who don't know, the tr the transverse engine is basically the engine that goes east to west. Whereas, yeah, that's right. it, whereas okay. in the older cars, it used to go north to south. So the engine used to go... Because it was a front-wheel drive. The Mini was front-wheel drive. Yeah. Yeah. What about Mr. Bean's Mini? <laughs> yeah, that, was, that was for sale a short while ago, actually. How much? It was 12000 13000 something like that. Only that much. They're not, that's not much at all. There was, no, there was a few. There was a few Minis that he used. It wasn't just that one. I see. Your favourite mini, if you could have any mini. Oh, the the one I've got now, my little mini. Uh, Cause I've got my little mini pickup. Yep. A, a little mini. Are pup. they rare? Yeah, very. Hmm. So that What's over here is really. Mm, twenty five. Twenty five thousand pounds for a pickup. Yeah. What about I've the got, mini I've... Moak? What's your view on the Moak? Oh, I love the Moak. The Moak's super cool. They're a lot of money. They're hovering they were a bit of a death trap, weren't they, or not? Yeah, well, all minis were, but they're hover hovering around 15 to 20,000 for a moak, for a decent one. What about the dream one? Is the California? California, I, I, you don't see many of those over here. Oh, okay. okay. We you had them in Australia, here. you know that? But you've got the Cooper, the, obviously the Cooper S, the Mark 1 Cooper S is there, the... Well, there was a Cooper S not so long ago sold. Um, it was a barn find, and it sold for 45000 And it was a bar find. It was an absolute wreck. What do you think of BMW and Mini? Tell me what you think. Uh, I think the first generation of BMW Mini... Well, BMW took over Rover in 1997. <coughs> That's yep. when they took it over. So technically, the last of the classic Minis were BMW. You got a super chat from Dude. <coughs> My wife really Dude, loves the Minis. Two dollars! I have a 64 Morris Mini Traveller. That's with the wood side panel. It is. It is. Is it true a BMW bought Rover thinking they were going to get Land Rover? They did get Land Rover. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did get Land Rover. Did they? Yes. yes. And then they sold it to the Indians. I mean, they lost a lot of money on Mini. Believe you me, Rover was a hemorrhaging dog. Okay. Rover sucked them dry. It nearly bankrupted BMW. They sold Rover for one pound, didn't they? Yeah. It was a disaster. Okay. British cars. Now tell me this. The Minis. Would you buy a BMW Mini now? Yes, no? Oh, I've, I've owned a few. Yeah, quite. You've I owned quite, a few BMW well, ones. Yeah, I quite like it. I, I had a, a 2006 uh, Cooper yeah. S. That was the one with the supercharged engine. Yeah, it goes it shower is shagged. Oh, God, yeah, it went like hell. The only problem with with it was the suspension was made out of glass. It was horrendous was the suspension. Mm -hmm. But no, it, it, it went well, very well. It sounded amazing. Why don't they last? They don't seem to last very long. Well, BMW. Plastic. plastic what do you think pump. of plastic? What, in the car or the person? <laughs> I think you start with the person. <laughs> in the car. In the car, plastic in the car, no, not a fan. Why do they use plastic? 
cheap. It's cheap. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Cost cut and It's supposed to be a prestige product. You know what I mean? Yeah, but the only if you ever want to know how well made a car is, go to a body repair shop and speak to the guys there and ask them the question. Arch, you and know those brown? I'll tell you the same thing. Volvo is the best made car. Now. Volvo is the best made car. If you speak to any body repair shop, that's what they'll tell you. Why? Volvo. They're just proper made. Proper made cars. Modern BMW, modern Mercedes, they're all the same. Garbage? Yeah, they're all super glued together. Arch, it's like uh, Louis Vuitton. You know there's like that, that brown uh, pattern? Like their brown pattern isn't even leather. It's plastic. It's it's actually canvas, but... Yeah, it's canvas, but... Yeah. yeah. It's supposed to be a luxury product, right? It, it's Same canvas, thing. okay? It's the reason to... they did that was because the leather yeah, would stink. Everything. It was on the stagecoaches, okay? So, Arch, just, just bringing the talk back to uh, Watch Talk, I'm curious what Tim's input is on Marco's decision. I personally am disappointed Tim didn't get the sermon for Marco. That's what really annoys me. Well, I yeah, can't 100%. get it for him. I told you guys. I feel I that mean, sentiment. You're, you're, I share that sentiment. You guys are acting as if I can get the sermon anytime I want. I, I yes, it, you only, can! You're only going to sell it for me, not to resell it. Come on, so guys. So what? Marco's a friend. He's a best friend. I love Marco. He could Marco. be a friend, but he has to make his Tim, own I wouldn't tell anybody. I can only put the good word in, but with the way he's acting, you know, I don't know if I can say, oh, this is the guy you can trust. Look. This is what I think about the 80s. <laughs> well, this is what I think why... about the 80s. <laughs> okay, then don't don't complain when when you are mystified why AD won't sell you a Rolex at retail. That Marco, has something right. to do with that. As long as I don't pay thirty-five thousand Aussie for for a, a Kermit, I don't care. I, I honestly do think I would sanction Tim selling a Sermit to Marco. I would sanction that. Okay, we have 100%. to sit down. I, I would have to sit down and tell you it'd be okay, but it didn't happen. Well, the AD can only sell me one good watch per year, and they said. And what do you think's either... coming out then that is so special? What do you think is so special? Let you me ask you this. What do you Explorer think is 2? so special? Archie, you <laughs> haven't seen the Explorer 2 mock-ups? Uh, Marco, bring it up. The bring ceramic. Up. This is Passion Report. Roll it. No, passion none of that ceramic garbage. No, 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 no. Marco, bring, bring it, it up. up. Bring it up. Yeah, I got to find it, though, guys. It's not that, yeah, not that easy it. to find. Yeah. It's not easy. Hold on, guys. But my worry is, is that's what's coming. And I have feeling in my bones that that's Arch, what we're going to get. Arch, Arch, we've got a plan, right? On at midnight, I think it's on the, is it the 3rd of April when Rolex are doing the release? So at yep. midnight on that day, I don't know what time it is in Australia. Let's do a live stream. Yep. Well, let's have the Rolex website on the on the stream live, yep. so we can Ooh. see the new watches, and let's see Tim's face when the Explorer Two is an absolute dog, and he's <laughs> passed up the sermon. What? What? No, no, I didn't pass it up. I said if it's not to my uh, specification, then I can still get the sermon. They, so, they didn't say. Just they're, take they're, the sermon for God's sake! What's the rush, so, guys? What? So Arch, is, 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 is that a plan? What am I going to do? do with it? Where can it? we do that? On, can we do that on this channel? I'm wearing you the You betcha sun. we can do that. What date? It's in April. It's months away. A month away. I think it's, a, I think it's April Here. 3rd, but it's midnight over in Switzerland. So okay, whatever time that is across that. the world. I'm wearing a bloody Here, Arch, sub, Let guys. me share my screen. What else does yep, a man need? Share the need? screen, Marco. Listen, I can't find the exact mock-up, but I'll tell you exactly what I think. So this is one possibility for the Explorer 1 right here. What do we think? What do we think? I I think this is what everybody has been saying it's going to be like. Hype tonight, frog, $2, yellow, gold, Explorer 2. Come in, laugh out loud. I don't think so. Betcha. I think it's going to be something be closer to this, except it's going to be... Except it's going to look like yes, this. Yes. I think it's going to look something like this. Arch. They're going to reissue there the Steve McQueen. Something like that. Oh. Oh, yeah. Imagine if they I do, Arch. Oh, it. my goodness. That's going to go I through the roof. 
but they're not known. The old one, you mean, or what? The new one? Yes, yeah, like yeah, if they the reissue a Steve McQueen des- like type of watch. But, but Rolex don't reissue though, do they? That's they the don't thing. Do, but... They don't go backwards. No, they do. They, they do. only go forward. No, they. Well, it won't Ami- be the same Amiga. thing, but it'll be similar. It'll be similar. Um, Amiga do reissues. Um, Rolex don't. It's not going to be a reissue. It's going to have the new modern movement, but it's going to have the old hands. You see, Rolex figured it out. Like people, when they initially released that design, the public wasn't ready. You know, people were not ready for that watch. That's why Rolex made it into like a Submariner homage. And then, and then look what they did. The first step they did is they changed the GMT hand and they put in the old Explorer 2 hand. And now the public loves the new Explorer. They love the new hand. Now they're going to put back the other two hands. They're going to take away the Mercedes hand. And people are going to finally appreciate the design that Rolex initially came out with. Because that Explorer 2 was absolutely perfect. It's just people were so dumb they couldn't understand it. And that's I think I think that's we're gonna be very I think we're going to be very underwhelmed. I think the, the best we can hope for is a green GMT hand. Oh, Ooh. green GMT and, hand. And the green text. Ah, ugly. Yeah, green no, text. No, no, no. I think, no, no, I, I, I think that's what they'll no, do. It's, it's 50th anniversary. Yeah, 50th anniversary. They're going to have some green on it. I found it. Green. I pulled it up. I found it. Okay, here we go. This is the one arch. Da, 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 da. There it is. Ah. blam. They won't do that. Woo! Kaboom! I just don't want to look. Look who made the mock-up, by the way. Rodent two, yeah. Rodent two. There we go. They're not. They're not going to do go. that. Ro- Rolex are it, not that. He, Rolex he are not cool website. enough to do that. Yeah, Rolex they wouldn't do it cool either. They're, they're it's cool. what we're praying for, but it will never happen. Amiga would do it. That's exactly Ro- Rolex what's going to. Ah, Amiga would have done it immediately and ruined it. And they would have put on the back. They would have wrote a thousand pieces out of a thousand. And then they put, put a Snoopy how you really on the side. Thing. Come on, guys. Talk you know, to us. Uh, Omega tell us how you really ruins feel. The re- re- reissues every single time. Tim, it's going to be your Explorer 2 with a green Jim T hand. Tell me this, guys. No, Do you no. think no. I'm then I'm going to get the survey. I want to hear from you now. Do you think I'm nuts? Archie, you're a madman. Archie, you're yep. a madman. You're even crazy. Here we go. Super Steel 75, five dollars. Rolex do not reissues. We have the old tenant, and now we have the new Sermit. It's very true. Seriously, yeah, out of these going. photos here, what should I get rid of? What do I keep? What do I sell? Tell me now, guys. Get rid of the five one nine six. Then you get rid of the calendar, and then we'll see. The annual Arch. calendar has to sell go. all it's of so them except for the 5196. And then when you realize you don't need the 5196, sell the 5196 also and get Rolex instead, Arch. Are these garbage or what? Arch, I explained this to you. The dress watch market is dying. ABC, ABC. <laughs> I was talking to you before, ABC. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, or was man. it Rolex? I can't remember. You said you couldn't believe how expensive these really me, were in that was real me. life. Oh, Who no, was I can't believe it. <laughs> that was me. What did you say, Lolex? Say that again. That really gave me a boner. <laughs> I just said <laughs> it, it, it hit me how expensive each one of them really are. You forget these are watches. You look at them. You kind of forget how much money each one of them costs. When you said that the five, what was it? The five one nine six. You're going to sell for twenty three five. That's a lot of money, man. That's a car. That's Aussie. It's not U.S. It's still a car. Well, an American car, a car in the U.S. Still, a garbage man, that's a lot car. Of money. Can we say that a garbage yeah. car? Yeah, that's to be fair. Ooh. It's just that's a lot of money, man. Five that's... years of Uber. It's like five to ten years of Uber. Dude, that's what do you mean by five that's years? That's Daytona. Of Uber? What do you mean by that? You can drive, five you can drive Uber for five years. That's eighteen four US. That's not much. That's a Daytona, man. Eighteen four is nothing. Tim, have you seen in the comments? Praveen has just said, and it's absolutely right. Huh? Only Tudor is allowed to remake. So I think you might see your dream come true in the Tudor brand. Ooh, I think that, you're that's not more wealthy likely. enough to have that much tied up in dress watches, Arch. Mm, but they remade the hand. They, they See how they took it? What would one, you flick? James, James, James I want to ask time. you this, man. You caused this trouble. You're the one who started this thing. What, James, I love you. You know that? You're a cool man. You're intelligent. If it was me, if, if, it, if it was me I'm not a dress watch guy, but... 
I would pick the traditional one. I would pick the front centre as a traditional dress watch How paddock. How many would you and keep? I would, if you had to keep I'd, three I'd, of I'd them? I'd keep one. I'd, no, I'd keep one. One paddock is a lifetime achievement. What the hell do you need five of the things for? To really rub it in! <laughs> but, 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 <laughs> with who? With the rodents! They're buying views! I don't buy views! <laughs> They're cheating Mark, if me. If you want more views, you got to get Rolex. That's the truth. Yeah, Marco's right. Marco's right. If you want more views, you want more subs, you need to plow that money into Arch, Rolex. My best performing videos are all with Rolex in the Rolex! <laughs> it's all with Rolex in the title. That's all people care about. Bear agrees with me. You got to do it, Arch. Plow your money into Rolex. And then when you finish making content, flip them and plow it into more Rolex. And then when you finish that, retire and buy all Amiga. Lolex players. Lolex! I got to tell you, man. Marco, I want to talk to you. You're the young pup. Okay, you're the young guy, right? Yeah. What do I keep out of this picture? What do I keep, Marco? Arch, I, I gotta rip the band-aid off because you know I love you oh. and I'm always gonna be honest with you, Arch. Yeah. You know what I'm about to tell you, right? No, I don't. No idea. You tell them all, Arch. You can't... Just listen. Arch, you've lived out the childhood fantasy of owning the Paddock Philippe's. You've crushed the rodents. You've got three Rolex, a Jaeger the Kultra, and you've got five Paddocks. You've crushed them. There's no more rodents available for you to crush. Arch, it's time to move on. Yeah, it's agreed. time to move on. Why don't you let the good fellas vote on this and then just do what we tell you? We can do a reverse <laughs> psychology. Well, that's not going to happen. Come on. And don't forget the Speedmaster, Arch. Are you flicking that Speedmaster? The Mark II? I don't have a Speedmaster. No, the, the Omega. Mark II. The Mark II. I don't have one. Oh, you oh, flicked it? One. Flick it, <laughs> flick it. You don't even realize he has. He March, has. I don't even March realize four and I half. have it. Arch, flick it, flick it. Sell it to some, spruik it to somebody. How much is it worth? I don't know, a couple grand. What? Probably yeah, a couple yeah, grand. Watch has actually grand. gone up. A watch has actually gone up over the past two years. Nino S. Two dollars. Agree with Mark. Keep the front three. James. 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 Arch, what are you going to do with a 30... How big is that, that annual calendar? 37 so, mils. Arch, it's 37 mils. It's a, bit, it's a bit small, let's be honest with one another. And those are the the three at the top are probably the three most... Or two of the three are the most expensive to service. I've already serviced them. Yeah, but still, you're going to have to service them down the line, Arch. When? What do you, eventually. And if you service them already, Arch, that means they'll pay. They'll sell for a little bit better. Arch, here's okay. a question: Which yeah, watch yeah. would you wear to a wedding, your son's wedding? Ooh, they're not gonna get married. I wouldn't be wearing nothing, one. man. They're not getting married. Those if, bunches if. aren't gonna showcase. I want to ask you, showcase. Yes. What would I? Should I do? What should I do? Tell me what I should do. Tell me which ones do I keep? Right. Think of it as a business. YouTube is your yes. business. Yes. yes the yes, yes. your current assets are earning you zero on the channel. Right? These five I don't assets know. Are you tell me. You t it gives me enthusiasm to make content. No, 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 no. The I don't think these give you enthusiasm to make content. I don't think they draw the crowd in. I yep. think if you take the net value of all these watches, liquidate yep. them and plow yep. and plow them plow the money into something that's going to bring content to the channel, which is Rolex, and then you have an appreciating asset that's bringing you quality content and it's giving, getting you more punters through the door and it's getting you more You'd subs sell and more the views. Lot. You would sell the sell lot. Sell a lot. Keep, keep sell the, the lot. Keep the, okay, ABC. Keep the, keep ABC, the man. ABC, man. What, what should I do? So, my question, so which watch would you keep for a formal occasion and sell the rest? Oh, well, I I reckon the five one nine six is the best yeah. for the formal yeah. occasion, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I think as well. It's the slimmest. It's the real icon. I mean, the six zero zero six is cool, but you don't wear it. If you wore it, fine. I I do wear it. I had this. You know, I've had women let me do things to them that 
shouldn't, you know, <laughs> it's kind of... I gotta tell you, Lolex, 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 Tim, 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 Tony Nico, <laughs> hey, here we up? go, Tony Nico, a man at Rolex saves for six months to make one, slaves at Rolex for six months to make one what blood, sweat and tears, Rolex is made by a CNC machine in a one day cultureless watch. Couldn't agree more, Tony, couldn't agree more, but Tim. listen, I don't know, it's not like I have crystal ball. Ooh. What should Archie do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ooh. What sort of mic stand have you got there, Tim? <laughs> what should Archie do? Oh, it's certain, guys. <laughs> All right, you heard it. Well, Welcome it's the same on. one as yours. Yeah, Tim is definitely smoking something. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> How cool that is. <laughs> it's going to make for great content. Arch, have What's you seen what this ch have you seen to what have you seen You're what the time on this channel has done to Tim? Is he insane or what? Oh yeah. <laughs> he, was quite, he was quite normal when he came on the first stream. In fact, in the first stream, I remember you saying he was boring and you booted him off the first stream. Oh, yeah. Look, well, well, I'm trying to look, jazz it up, guys. Look what you've done to him. I love his studio lights, by the way, man. That's so spooky. I amped do, it up, guys. Do you do Six, tarot readings? Arch, I like the 600 now books you never read in the background. <laughs> Check yeah. out his video. What's a Euro, Tim? <laughs> What's up? Watch and pray. Watch and pray. Five dollars. Although Paddock, although Paddock is refined, the Calatrava is the dog of the line. Grand comp or get out. Yeah, I wouldn't that's say true, that. Actually. A world time is not a dog, guys. Come on, that's ridiculous. World Off time, world time is probably the the most desired Paddock outside of in the dress watch range outside of Grand Comp. So. Right, so Th those kind of moon no, face chronos are bread and butter. Desirable. Uh, I don't know, <laughs> I, I don't know about that one. If you look at a 5230 or you look at a five, what's Arch, what's the Khaleesi Dow, the reference for the Khaleesi 51 Dow? 5131. The 5130 ones are through the roof. <laughs> they are, yeah. Here we go, Cripe tonight, frog, two dollars. Nice bedroom grenade, Timmy. <laughs> I, love this, I, I love this comment from Mikey. Uh, Tim Wright has a bloody video on the lights. There's five minutes of my life I'm not getting back. <laughs> this literally mm. was five minutes missing in that. That's so, I don't know how I missed that. Man, it's not easy. That's what editing. too many it's edibles easy, does to you guys. Stay off. I'm re-uploading it. I'm re-uploading it, guys, as we speak. So, guys, like any, anyone minutes. who's anyone who's watching this stream right now, right? If you ever want to build a relationship with your AD, you've got to act exactly like Tim. He's zany as yeah. hell. Yeah. And this is how you, this is how you get Rolex and an AD. Hey guys, well, all you got to do is be born ball. into rich oligarch money, and you're good. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're going to wrap this show up. I reckon let's give it seven more minutes, seven, six and a half minutes. I want to say, mm -hmm. firstly, I want to make a very special announcement. Marco, congratulations. Rolex. It's amazing, man. You're going to love it. I I'm want to say special thank you to Tim, Nico, Nico, Tony, Nico for being such a cool sport, man. I am sorry yeah. I was a jerk. Yeah, he's a jerk. Arch, either way you go, listen, you can't go wrong. You know what I mean? Man, those Paddock Philippe's, Arch, are... Man, most people slave an entire lifetime and can't even get one. You got five of the things, Arch. Mm. ABC, I love you, laughing. man. You know this ABC... Yeah, that's, uh, you know, right back at you. I really do think you're, um, you're a cool guy. Arch, James, can I just say I one thing? I want to say this to you. Sorry? I think we might have missed a super chat from DJ Dommy. Sorry, we're just scrolling up the chat. It's a way, DJ it's a little Dommy? bit. Yeah, yeah, I'll get that one now. Let's get that one. DJ Dommy. D 
Oh, yeah. DJ Dummy, $2. Punters don't want to see Grandad's watch Rolex. I think it says sell the paddocks, get the Rolex, right? I got a point there, you know. I don't know what to do, guys, but I tell you one thing for sure. The watches, I love my watches. I want to say that to you, okay? I love you guys. You guys mean more to me than money. It's the, it's, about heard this it's about the camaraderie, right? The, the I sense of community. You guys, seriously, I really enjoy you guys. The other crew, I tell you the truth, I hated them. I didn't even like them. You guys, yeah. I Look really do love. I really do love you guys. And Marco, man, you young guy. If we could help you get a Alexa, sub... turn on the light. Arch, did you see what I, I posted in the comments? When to, uh, Mark was on a, a Bruce Williams live stream. <laughs> yes, I, said, I did I, see that. I really like Paddock Philippe, and I listed off all the references that you own. Oh, that was classic. <laughs> yes. You want, you want me to pull the picture up? I can pull it up for you if you want. No worries. You can do anything you want. Watch and pray, $5. Although Paddock is refined. Okay, we heard that one there. Tim, did you frog. Just... Nice bedroom grenade, Timmy. I want to say this to you guys. <laughs> I love you. Guys, I'm going to end the show today now, and I want to see you back tomorrow. Marco, please, can you film it? I want to put it on my main channel, man. That is going to be... I love it, but man. How, how do we do it? What do you mean an unlisted video? That means no Can't one I just can make see it, a... it. Then I can download it and put it up on the You can only see it with a link. Channel. Okay. The, yeah, I just want to do You've got that, the option man. where you can do I private. But then I can... Public. Right, and then we'll I can promote your channel it. as well. We'll promote your channel. We'll promote. Awesome, I appreciate that. 